Hi there, my name is Jack the Fallout and welcome back to Blade and Sorcery. So the Outer Rim mod has been updated for U10 and I wanted to ask the question, can you beat Blade and Sorcery as a Jedi? This here dungeon is filled with evil. That's the thumb there. Upon initially entering the dungeon, I draw my blade. You see this poor fella here. This guy didn't even have a chance to draw his lightsaber. I believe the woman behind him was kind of screaming against blood. I entered the first room, draw my lightsaber, and the battle begins. She unfortunately died way too easy for me to even call it a challenge. Absolutely pathetic, didn't even put up a fight. Oh. Entering my second room, I fought two people valiantly, cutting both of her arms off, stabbing her in the chest, and as the Sith die, I know I'm doing good by the Jedi Order. I saw someone in the distance and I tried to get their attention, but Jedi Mind Trick Fireball will do. There we go, got your attention. With a quick flick of my wrist, I removed the Sith Lord's hand, and my lightsaber totally did not just get caught in the wall, you saw nothing. Are you trying to pick up a lightsaber while you're... One of the many, many perks of being a Jedi is having the ability to use the Force. So I used the Force to carry this jug down, and I, I spotted a bridge, and I threw the jug at someone on the bridge, and I missed. I guess we'll do it the old-fashioned way. I hook my axe on the zipline, I slide down, get out my lightsaber, I'm ready to take on my foes. I jump and I stab, she faints for some reason, I threw my lightsaber, and I... I, I lost it. I, yes, okay, I lost my lightsaber. To make things even worse, I fell to my death. Okay, that's run number one failed. Eager to get back in the action, I jump and nearly fall to my death, and then I get out my lightsaber and I attack the tree because I hate trees. And then a lightsaber battle happens because Star Wars. Until I cut her arm off and stab her in the throat, but she didn't. Oh, no, she's dead. Okay. Took a while for you to die, but you're now dead, and that's good. Jedi tip number one. Go for the hand. You will disarm them. Jedi tip number two. Jump attacks are useless against lightsabers. I collected a stool sample, and I force push it towards someone. Lucky for me, they have not seen me yet. What the hell is going on? What are you doing? The Sith is a joke. When I finally get their attention, I force push a barrel into a woman's face. It blocks a lightsaber attack so that I can attack them with my energy sword because I'm like really cool and shit. Of course, being the world's greatest Jedi, these two Sith Lords didn't stand a chance against me. Now, how am I going to get across here? Uh, oh. <laughs> Luckily enough, I pull myself up and cut his leg off. I force push a corpse towards my enemy. They attack me, I block. I make him visit the second hand shop and stab him in the chest. But they're not really going to the second hand shop because they're dead. This bit just kind of speaks for itself. See, I told you so. Spoke for itself. I pick up a pot using the force and I yeet it into the distance. It distracts someone and then an epic Star Wars battle happens. Well, it was going to be epic. And then someone lost their arm and their head. A man sees me and faints and tries to do battle. It obviously didn't work out for him. Like at all. I jump and funny Star Wars me. Hello there. Why do they always faint? I know I'm scared. Oh the God, Sith have turned on each they're other. They're fighting each other. Get them all the weak. Sword to a lightsaber fight? How stupid are you? Oh my God, I'm this woman right here is a definition of having a bad day. I enter a room, I draw my blade, and I'm ready to do battle. Yeah. 
and then he starts sparking like he's some kind of hyper-realistic Sith battle droid. I mean, he dies like a human. This person faints at the sight of my lightsaber, but out of the kindness of my Jedi heart. Okay, you know what? I'm going to fight you honorably. So, come on then. Oh, two lightsabers. Yes, I've been waiting for this. The horns will sound. I'll draw my blade and the Sith and I will fight to the death. But they haven't noticed me yet. Oh, no, I'm not in there. I'm over here. Oi, miss, I'm over here. This will be my toughest challenge yet. All of the Jedi training has led up to this moment. And this moment alone. Okay, f fine. I I lost my lightsaber again, all right? You happy? Not another one. But lucky for me, I came prepared and brought another one. Well, okay, I found it, but still. Okay, this isn't me editing. This is my Oculus. So my Oculus uh, couldn't find my Guardian, and therefore paused the game. Oh, we're back, it's all good. Back to murder. Back to the Star Wars murder. Yes, the best kind of murder is Star Wars murder. You fell off the cliff, you dumbass. Are you dead? Oh god. Oh, oh, oh. I am relieved that I have overcome my hardest challenge yet. That was difficult. This Sith Lord surprised me from around the corner, but contrary to the rest of this run, it didn't really go very well for him. Ooh -wee. I slide down the rope, expecting an enemy to reveal themselves. But there isn't an enemy, is there? No. I go through the tiny little doorway and yes, I've done it! I have answered the age-old question, can you beat Blade and Sorcery as a Jedi? And yes you can beat Blade and Sorcery as a Jedi. Thank you for watching, my name is Jack the Fallout, if you like what you see here don't forget you can subscribe, it's 100% free and I really appreciate it. We have a Patreon. If you want to support me on Patreon and help me continue to do what I love to do, then links in the description. Thank you to Strooman for being our current Patreon. And I'll see you very soon, mutants. Bye-bye. Well, this was a lot of fun. I should do this again. For everything!